in the morning, if you don't get up early in the morning and go outside, you're really missing it. It's, it's quiet. You can watch the birds build their nest. Just a tranquility out there. It's, uh, you get lost, you know, when you're out doing fencing or working animals, you just kind of get lost in the quiet and the nature. Like God's country is what I call it. Jean Barcroft. I'm a country girl. We are people that are very independent and we don't like to ask anybody to do anything for us. We usually figure it out and do it ourselves. All of our neighbors are farmers and most of the kids we went to school with were farmers so we fit right in. 50 years ago the average farm size was probably 100 acres you know, with a family on it and three or four kids, and now the average farm size is a couple thousand acres. Agriculture's a hard life. One little drought or one little plague, one little anything will destroy you. But if you have a nest egg where you're getting a nice income from another source, that seems like, you know, a godsend. We had gotten letters from uh, probably numerous other solar companies and it never panned out. So uh, we just figured this was another one, but we made the call anyway, just uh, gave them a chance. We uh, spoke to S Power and uh, it just went on from there. We just started feeling uh, like this was something that we could do with our land that would, uh, would help everyone really. It's producing clean energy. They don't make any noise. It doesn't affect your animals. It doesn't affect the farm next to it that's being farmed, I don't have a problem with it. My dad always used to preach to us over and over. He said, leave whatever you do better than when you came. Shucks. Of course it'll. You know, my grandparents, mom and dad, they weren't just thinking about themselves. They wanted to build something, they wanted to pass it down. And uh, that's a goal of ours, mm -hmm. be able to pass it down. Yep. I want this planet to be here for my grandchildren and their children, and we've got to start doing something. I'd like to be part of it. I think I know he would too.